Let me start by prophesying over your life. I think when I was praying, the Lord gave me a scripture, Deuteronomy chapter 8, 7 to 9. I have to obey God and speak it over your life. Then I'll charge our hearts tonight. Just allow me read and then I'll speak it over your life. For the Lord thy God bringeth thee. This is the scripture that came to me while I was praying. Into a good land. A land of brooks of water. Of fountains and depths that spring out of valleys and hills. A land of wheat and barley and vines and fig trees and pomegranates. A land of oil, of olive and honey. Verse 9. A land wherein thou shalt eat bread without scarceness. Thou shalt not lack anything in it. A land whose stones are iron. And out of whose hills thou mayest dig it brass. This is provision even in the times of scarcity. Even though I'm not teaching on finances tonight, but I have to obey the Lord. In the name of Jesus, by the power of prophecy, I'm praying for you. That beginning from this week, may you step into a strange level of financial testimonies. We call upon God who has graciously shown us mercy. That in the name of Jesus Christ, everyone connected to this grace, I'm prophesying to you by the spirit of the living God. Not, not in two weeks, not in three weeks, not next year, not in March. You have the faith to believe I speak over your life. In the name of Jesus, step into a realm of extraordinary abundance. Abundance by the wisdom of God. Abundance by the favor of God. Abundance by strategic relationships. Abundance by inheritance. In the name of Jesus. So don't be surprised if someone who has not called you in a long time calls you and says, God, just put it in my heart that for the remaining part of this year, every month, not once, not twice, every month that I should be blessing you and blessing your children. You have the faith to believe it. I speak it over your life. I bless your week beginning. Say amen. I bless your week beginning. Enjoy favor. Enjoy multiplication. Enjoy honor. Nothing is missing in your life. Nothing is broken in your life. Trouble is far from you. You will enjoy the help from God. You will enjoy the ministry of destiny help us. In the name of Jesus, every tongue that rises against you, it falls in judgment. You will enjoy joy unspeakable, even full of glory. May the Lord anoint you afresh and make you a mighty battle axe. May the Lord anoint you afresh and cause you to be a sign and a wonder. Everything works in your favor. In Jesus' mighty and matchless name we pray. Together let's share the grace, the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit. Rest and abide with us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely, God's goodness and mercies follow us all the days of our lives as we dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. God bless you. See you on Sunday.